family whom we have known also from those days of General Green and so on. One of the common things between the Scots and Indians is that we have fought the Britishers very hard. <laughs> <laughs> they won much earlier, we are kind of slow, we, we operate on Indian standard time, so we win whenever we want to, but that's the commonality. So we won. We won. <laughs> and, uh, you know, Radhika is kind of, where's Kate? This is solely for your benefit, man. She's very obstinate and demanding. <laughs> However, we have solved the problem by once in a while spanking her. You are right to go for it. Okay? <laughs> in spite of those behaviors, she's also very hardworking. And like all ex and current tar healers would say, you can only be a hardworking person and very intelligent to get into the great school at Chapel Hill. Some people disagree, and you know. Yes, we do. <laughs> you know, we have NC State. We have two, three young people from App State. And we've got Wake Forest too, something. Uh, Wake Forest, yes, but you know, both their siblings are at App State, and they think that's the better school. Uh, who, who knows? Yep. <laughs> but you know, it's, it's great to welcome Ian amongst us. Uh, one of the things they're planning for a honeymoon to uh, after their wedding in, to India and they want to travel on palace on wheels. So uh, here is one thing I believe it's not very cheap. I may say it's kind of dear expensive trip. So anyone of you get their invitation who are lucky enough to be invited for the wedding. 
<laughs> when you get the wedding registry and stuff, you know, buying anything there, you can contribute to my funds because my wife, my wife has already agreed to sponsor that trip. She never comes at me, she just said yes. So, you know, I will, I'll take any money because we all know that we all work within budgets unlike our great government. <laughs> we cannot be deficit <laughs> Sajeev, did you call press here tonight? <laughs> no, no. But that's the only, only place I'll go politic. Now let me read my notes. Uh, <laughs> I'm well prepared, man. So what? Surgery, anesthesia, oh, yeah, dreams, this <laughs> all fine. But he's also 50 plus, so it might be onset of early Alzheimer's. And a word of advice to Ian. Uh, she is, as I used to call her, or I still call her, she's my princess. We have, you know, very tenderly brought her up. Or at least I have. She's, snail is not tender in any way. <laughs> as you all know. But, uh, I was worried how will Radhika get around with Ian. And then, yeah, the day before she came back home with henna on her hands, and I saw these two, Ian cutting a piece of pork chop, feeding her, wiping his mouth, and I said, man, what a sucker, but <laughs> she is going to treat her well. So welcome. Yeah. Please, you want anyone else to toast for you? Mark? No. I just want to say thank you, everybody, to come out. This has been... Uh, this whole engagement that we've had so far for the last, I don't know, four or five months has been wonderful, but it becomes so much more meaningful when we see all these people that are part of our families that are uh, with us on this journey together. So thank you so much for coming tonight. Um, we really appreciate it. So I guess we raise our glass now. <laughs> Empty it out. Empty it out. Thank you. Congratulations, guys. Very good. 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 Very